Headquartered just outside Washington, D.C., the U.S. Center for Chinese Medicine is on a mission to teach the United States and the world about traditional Chinese medicine, or TCM. Dr. Xu Kai Zhang is the director. The spread of Chinese medicine to uh, worldwide is, uh, is quite uh, important. The and center trains medical professionals and is affiliated with Beijing University of Chinese Medicine. Chinese medicine actually uh, originated in China uh, thousands of years ago. We take the relationship between the human being and the nature, the human being of the society, and even inside the body. Balance is the priority. TCM uses techniques like acupuncture, herbal medicine, and massage. The best way for me to learn more about traditional Chinese medicine is to get a consultation. My main complaint, sore knees, back pain, and tinnitus ringing in the ears. The doctor asks questions. How's your appetite? Uh, always good. Oh, yeah, that's... Dude, a, that's another problem. Uh, yeah, it's a little good. bit... Uh, and conducts an exam, checking my tongue and monitoring three different pulses. To take a view of your of the balance in your body. Then it's on to the exam table. TCM is based on the concept of qi, an energy or life force with two equal and opposite components, yin and yang. Energy flows along meridians in the body. The doctor is pretty quickly able to identify parts of my body that needed treatment. His initial conclusion, deficiency of the yin aspect of my kidneys. First, specialized massage, then acupuncture, focusing on the meridian associated with the spleen, liver, and kidney. He checks my pulse and tongue as he goes. Oh, I can feel your strength of your pulse got improved. Very good. So far, so good. Now to focus on the tinnitus, which means a needle in the top of my head, one right in the center of my forehead, one near my ear, and one in my wrist. And the ringing in my ears improves. The needles remain in place for about 20 minutes. I'm told to relax and focus on breathing. TCM has gradually gained acceptance outside China. The U.S. National Institutes of Health has found acupuncture and other TCM treatments to be safe and effective for some medical conditions. And the agency is studying broader applications. In recent years, the World Health Organization has embraced traditional medicine, including TCM, especially in conjunction with Western medicine. The needles come out, and the doctor recommends continuing my treatment. Dr. Zhang says traditional Chinese medicine helps the world, while allowing Americans to have a positive interaction with Chinese culture. Uh, traditional Chinese medicine makes uh, us, uh, the society more harmonious, the society more balanced, and uh, not only help our body inside, but also the whole society, the whole world in certain way. Jim Spellman, CGTN, Rockville, Maryland.